Are we live, damn it? Are we? Work, damn you, work! No, not... Really? It says it's streaming, damn it! <laughs> yes, 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 work, work, please work. Ah, it runs, it leaves. Thank you, thank you, phone. Anyway, welcome one, welcome all. To the Kissiness Rebel livestream. Who do you love and who loves you, huh? Let's finally get into Arcanum. After so much trouble, it runs, which is good. It is really nice music, I must say. I like the classical stuff. So classical. <laughs> classical music is music for the soul, my friend. Mm. That's you, intro. No, we have seen this intro. Damn it! No, I thought it was the other intro. Anyway, let's go. New game. Pick character and new character. We shall create a new character. Choose a name. We shall be. We shall be. Yeah. If it works, it works. <laughs> so, Lina. Uh, we want to be male or female. I guess we'll be a male, an alpha male. Human, dwarf, elf, 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 gnome, halfling, <laughs> halfling, half orc, half ogre. Dark Elf, Ogre, Orc, Human. Your character creator is still kinda like mine, just with dirt instead of darkness. <laughs> yeah, I guess dirt is better. Uh, it would be weird. I had I had a dark window. I I don't know how it fixed itself, but it did. Uh, no significant background. Raised by snake handlers. Uh, Apprentice to a blacksmith. Raised by elves. Raised by monks. <laughs> Child of a hero. Inheritance. Well, we had no inheritance, so... Yeah. Special person. You have suffered... From... <laughs> oh my god, I can't... I don't... I know this word, but I can't read it. Congenital brain damage. You lack intelligence minus two, but you receive more praise. When you do do a good deed, resulting in a better re reaction from people. Ah, so I can be retarded. <laughs> Sorry, a, a person with special needs. <laughs> Professional knife tosser. You used to work as a knife thrower in a circus until losing an eye in a freak accident. Sadly, you lose a point perception, but you gain an ex uh, exponential bonus to your throwing skill. <laughs> uh, apprentice to a shopkeeper. Spending your whole childhood inside a shop, you gain an exceptional bonus to haggle, but you suffer penalty of to dexterity. <laughs> These are awfully realistic. <laughs> you were born during an uh, born under a siege. <laughs> you were born during an astronomical event. As a result, your experience fever, critical hit, fewer critical hits and critical misses, but when you do get them, their results tend to be spectacular. Yeah, yeah critical miss. Uh, extreme personality. You pose an extreme personality. People react more strongly to your presence and tend to grow to either love you or hate you. 
bookworm. Wait, how many of these are here? You have spent most of your life reading. You gain a bonus to intelligence. Unfortunately, Mayofia has set him and <laughs> you lose points in perception. Yes, I have started to go blind. Bully. You were the class bully. Big and dumb. Extortion and intimidation have afforded you a bonus to strength, but getting people to do your homework for you leaves you with deficiency in intelligence. Makes sense. Elven blood. Your father's great grandmother was an elf. You gain an increase in magic or latitude, but suffer slightly poor. slight penalties to all tech skills. So if you're an elf, no technology, only magic. You are constantly busy. Hyperactive. You spend a high, uh, high, higher than normal, but most people find you annoying. And your charisma suffers, minus one. So what would I give myself? What am I? Army training. You received some army training during your youth, but were discharged for having flat feet. <laughs> this could be my brother, he has flat feet. You gain bonus in strength, as well as slight bonuses to your bow and melee skill, but you have a penalty in dexterity. Hmm. Shelter child. <laughs> you were cold and coddled in <laughs> incessantly as a child. As a result of overprotective -pro parenting, you take a severe penalty to strength, but being more sensitive, you have a bonus to intelligence, willpower, and perception. Troll offspring, oh my god. Uh, ran away from the circus, raised in the pits. How many of these are there? Sickly... <laughs> <laughs> Bit with an ugly stick, you are ugly. There is just no other word for it, unless you consider hideous a better word. <laughs> a word. <laughs> Children flee from you in terror, and even the kindest of souls find it difficult to stand in your presence for long. As a result of your con uh, countenance. Content Continents, you take an extreme penalty to beauty, but because you have had to defend yourself from frequent attacks, you gain a bonus to snack. Ladies man, raised by orcs, challenge for a take, educator, escape lunatic, <laughs> idiot savant, <laughs> mentally handicapped, barbarian, Nietzsche poster child. Nietzsche once said, That which does not kill me makes me stronger, and he may have been referring to you. All your life you have been making mistakes, but you always seem to come out better oh. <coughs> afterwards. In other words, you critically fail more than normal, but you have them some experience points bonus. Soldier soul. No, bought a soul. They mage. Night Mage, Sky Mage, Nature Mage, Agrophobic, Hydrophobic, Afraid of the Dark, Magic, Magical Allergy, Arsonist, oh this one will fit me, you like fire, no you love fire, 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 yes I agree, you were always picked on as a kid, no I don't agree with that, I was the picker, being scrawny, Synchronous strength minus one, constitution minus one, but you showed them you studied explosives, gaining two strategies, and you burned their homes. Turned on that, burned them to the ground. Ha ha ha. Then you ran away from home and snuck aboard the Zephyr, which seemed highly climbable. <laughs> oh my god. An excellent target. You probably would have torched the Zeppelin if you hadn't been shot down. <laughs> this is a good one. Bandit. Technophobia, only child. Frankenstein's monster. What if I found a Mad doctor. <coughs> Needed the operation. Dark sight. No significant background. Raised by snake handlers. The master is a hard man. You gain bonus to strength, bonus to rap, repair skill, but you suffer penalty to dexterity. Hard labor. You know what? We will be the. <laughs> Where is it? Arsonist. 
whatever, whatever awaits. I think this one suits us. The Flamen Warfare. Do you want to be human? No special modification to the stats and abilities. Humans are the most popular. Well, I am a human. Do I want to be a dwarf? Elf. Half elf. Gnome. Halfling. Dwarf. Not really. I'll be my human. I'll take my arsonist, please. Yes. Male. Female. Legendary race. You can with. And pain, exhaustion, and toxin better than male. You receive plus one to constitution, but you are slightly weaker and receive minus one to strength. I'll be a male, thank you. Male arsonist. <laughs> mm, my portrait. Who resembles me the most? <laughs> Let's see. Oh, uh, you'll be Mr. Mustachio, huh? Yeah. Although I don't have a mustache, but. Not much to choose from. Yeah, let's be the mustache. You can see the flame in his eye. <coughs> okay, so damage bonus minus one, <laughs> AC adjustment minus two. So I can't really hit anything. Heal rate two, poison recovery seven, reaction modifier minus seven. Initial reaction that others have is based on beauty. What am I ugly? Am I that ugly? 28 hit points. Yup. Ah, I have a, ah, 5 points to spend. Fatigue. <laughs> so, what about? <coughs> Let's say we want some hit points for the start. Uh, what are these things? Skills. Nope. Ah, uh, technical disciplines. The button will activate the display of technological disciplines below. There are 8. Disciplines with each available degree. Healing. Salt. Oh, foo, foo, foo. Aha! Oh my god. Should I have just picked a character? And you probably need DX and will be a thrower. Yeah, we shall see. I have seen when I installed the game. Uh, backstep, pickpocket. Prowling. Stop trap. Gambling, Hangover, Heal, Persuasion, Repair, Firearms, Picklock. I have seen the Flammenwerfer! <laughs> Age 20. I'm a bit older than that. What is this? Mm, this arm. Ghost, I must say, I don't understand any of these. <coughs> I guess I do need stuff. Should I just... No, 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 we will be instead of a... But... Hmm... Dexterity, you say. Uh, I have three points left. Do I want... You know what, let's leave this as it is for now. We shall see. Let's give myself some... Uh, Charisma 8. Perception 8. Good power. We lack in the strength department. And what is this? Const... Constitution. The endurance limits of the body. We should add a bit to this. One more point, let's... <sighs> let's... Play forward then P. Since it's firearm, right? I don't know. <laughs> I have just seen we have alignment meter. Yeah, don't really care. Let's give myself... Hmm. AC, armor class, damage bonus, this... Hmm... Let's add a charisma. I might be able to haggle for low, lower prices. Until I re... Uh, wait, wait, wait. Handcrafted flintlock, broken flintlock, pistol, metal tube, make guns, elixir of... Perseverance, Molotov cocktail. I think that's a bit. It's a firearm, right? <laughs> uh, magic tech meter. Nah. Okay, let's. What is this? Mm, auto level schemes. Well, I should have well used that. Wait. I have a suit. I have my some cash. Mm. Hmm. 
for the trivial amount of 20 coins it will be yours Human shopkeeper but I need ammo and ammo might not be easy to find at the beginning of the game so I might actually need something to hit stuff with <coughs> wait for the stones <laughs> the axe uh, mace what is this chain oh rifle uh, how many I have 400 coins should I let's, not... let's get the sword although can I tell it to just random me yeah? whatever is on me but you know what listen I will not buy anything let's just go I was caught with my pants down on the blimp. Let's put it like that. You find yourself aboard the Zephyrus Zephyr. Why? Why? choice but to do as he said there are so few of us left but the work is almost finished and then the evil oh, you can't imagine he's coming back to destroy everything everything and everyone please just find the boy <coughs> tell him that I escaped Came back to warn. <coughs> he will know what to do. You, my friend, it's all up to you. No, old man. What boy? What boy? I can't believe it. I mean, you and and then the zeppelin and, and the fire and the altar says that. Do you have any idea what all of this means? What are you going on about? By the gods, man, I almost died here. <laughs> Didn't you see the crash? You speak! I, I mean, of, of course you speak. What am I, a blathering idiot? Wait, what, what did you say? Maybe I should be writing all of this down. Hmm, fumbles in pockets of his robes. <laughs> What the bloody hell are you talking about? Outreated man. I'd like to help you out here, but I'm a bit confused. 
I am at a loss here. I, I, I don't quite know what to do. Uh, I mean, you are the, the, oh, of course you are. I mean, you do know who you are, right? Of course you do. What, what, what sort of brainless, half-baked question is that for the, the, uh, the, uh, what, 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 what do you call yourself? <laughs> am I being unclear? Your babbling is, is incomprehensible. Please, sir, slow down and tell me. Uh, what is it that you're saying? Please, forgive me. I, I'm making a bloody mess of this whole affair. My name is Virgil, sir, and I'm new to the Panari religion. Uh, your religion, and I... Oh, 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 wait! I, uh, hereby dedicate... No, no, uh, commit my life to the living one. I... Virgil, I'm at your service, sir. Just because we crashed in a zeppelin doesn't mean we can't be a gentleman. <laughs> and... What is he babbling about? What do you mean? The living one. Quit speaking in riddles. Virgil, please, you really need to explain things here. I don't mean to be rude, but I'm just not who you think I am. Yes, right, I am... <laughs> you may, uh, rise and serve me, royal Virgil. Yes, we, yes, we yes of course believe. you're not really him, just his reincarnation. I I mean, the case, right? I have to admit, I'm no expert in elven philosophy or, or, or prophecy. Bloody confusing, you know. All those these thous. <laughs> not, not that it's not interesting. Um, <clears throat> yes, right. Uh, just give me a moment here. You, you see, the Panari... That's the religion that was formed around the things that he said. I, I mean, that you said. Oh, forget it. Let, let's start at the beginning. Or this beginning, since there is a lot more that came before this. You are the reincarnation of a powerful elf who the Panari worship and whose name is, uh... Right. Yes, uh, the name. Oh, uh, wait. I remember something. It is written in the scriptures. The living one will live again on wings of fire. Mm. No, 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 wait. I think it says, reborn on wings of fire. Oh, blood and ashes. Why do elves always have to be so damn cryptic? It's bullshit. The <laughs> scripts speak of a dying gnome and the ring. The one ring, the one to rule them all. In darkness, find them. Hmm. I don't know about the ring. But this business about the evil one returning... Oh, as I've said, I don't know a whole lot about the Panari prophecies, but I think you were supposed to return and fight someone evil. Ah, oh, bloody hell! I should know more of this. You don't seem well... <clears throat> you don't seem well versed in scriptures. So, I meant to be some great religious figure. That's ludicrous. I make it a rule not to speak with religious fanatics. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Is this confusing to you? Imagine how it, I must feel, yes. I would like to clear up your confusion, but I am new to the Panari religion myself. I must bring you to meet my mentor, Elder Joachim. He can answer your questions. He is in Shrouded Hills, a town at the base of these mountains. Who is this Joachim fellow? Well, let's go talk to Elder Joachim and straighten things up. Things out. I'm not interested in your foolish... Foolishness, good, good day, sir. Joaquim, well, gave me a hand when I needed it. Showed me mm. the truth of the Panari and its beliefs. He's a very wise man, and will know what needs to be done. Well, let's go talk to this Joaquim fellow and straighten things out. I'm not a religious type, I'll be going on my own way. Goodbye. The path out of here leading down to Shrouded Hills is down to the southeast. We'll stop by the Panari shrine on the way out. Save See as much as possible. makes any of this any more clear. We should look for any other survivors before we leave, though. How dare you think? Uh, I agree. I couldn't care less about these unlucky buggers. Let's go. Uh, I agree. Let's search for survivors. Okay. Is there a quick save button? Ah, I must escape and save game. I will. I will. Let's check the dead gnome. What do we have? Matchbook from the Rose Brook Inn. Uh, what does it say about the One Ring? The ring, One Ring to rule them all. It's an old silver ring. The Initials GB are set in value upon its face.
and the word P show and sounds are inscribed on its inside and the band. Uh, the passport of a man named <laughs> Preston <laughs> Red. Red if. Yeah. So I got his passport. Too bad, they'll never identify his boy. Uh... No, no button. Uh, how do I open my inventory? Can I put the ring on my hand? I can! Well, thank you, sir. It's his fault, he did not say. Who am I supposed to return the ring to? But we shall see. Maybe it gives something special, who knows. No, wrong button again. Uh, Virgil. What is it that you want of me? Hmm. I'd like to be healed. Just a few more questions, please. I'd like to do something for me, Virgil. I will, I will be departing now. Hmm. What can I answer for you? I'd like to know a few things about you, Virgil. Ah, I can see him. His stats and stuff. Ah. Dodge. <laughs> but how do I... In myself, I uh, just say like one, two, three, not quick save, so I can return to some points. Ah, we shall, we shall keep that in mind. <coughs> oh, but boss, give me a piece of advice. <coughs> How do I turn off the windows? Vine, yes, you take. Sweet, sweet vine. What is this? Metal plates. So, if I have the inventory open, like this, can I click anywhere? Well, turn it off. Or must I press I every time? Uh, anything in the crash? Oh no, a woman! Uh, Clarice Forok. No, she's dead. Marvin, I'm locked dead. Hmm, can I loot you, Marvin? Can I open your inventory, check your pockets? Yeah, let's collect steel. Ooh. Filament. Ah, you had something. Uh, thermometer, I'll take, why not? And a camera. This camera looks damaged from the crash. Not really how to use, but what can one do? Hmm. Max Evil Eye. What kind of passenger were you, sir? Uh, or is McLeary dead? Ooh, large. Springs, I'll take, why not? Top left, it shows a small screen in the character of the world. Ah! 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 Thank you, ghost. Look at Bloodstone. Hmm. Really, do they have nothing? Did all of their money fall out of their pockets when they died? When they fell? Although I must say, the crash it looks really nice. Uh, no, nope, no, Virgil! A dog. Kick, kick, kick! <laughs> really, attack the wolves. Where did he fall? Hmm, can't check your corpse, my good sir. Too bad. Hmm, can't get into the caves. You know, this game reminds me of. Ooh, fine. I'm glad the vine survived the crash. Uh, poor. Really, Virgil, stop attacking everything. I have no weapon, man. Are you blind? No. What in God's... I, I mean, better luck next time. <laughs> well, it was just a boar, Virgil. Where can I get a stick like yours? Ooh, plane. What is this? It seems a strange flying device, but much smaller than the Keep blimp. Because I've never seen anything like it. it. Hmm, I will. Yes, it looks very much like the machine which attacked us. It is one of the machines that attacked us. And isn't that an ogre among the wreckage? Ogre? It seems very unlikely that an ogre would have the intelligence to fly such a complex device. Yeah, it is an ogre. Virgil, don't be racist. <laughs> Do you see that strange Although amulet that he's wearing? And that symbol on its face? I don't recognize it. Do you? Hmm, I will check. I can't say that I do. Ah, uh, something isn't quite right about all of this. I don't remember the, uh, scriptures talking about flying ogres and the like. We'd better get to Shrouded Hills and find Elder Joachim as soon as possible. Yes, 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 reveal Virgil. Let's and be do careful. So. These wolves are none too friendly. 
Ogre Bandit. Ah, he has a Jewish amulet. This amulet has a strange symbol on its face. That's an eye of hexagram. Uh, we shall take. What did I collect? Filament, yes. Hmm, can I wear this? Might as well wear the Ogre's Blin. <laughs> what else can one do in an adventure game? Metal plate. Can I use it as a weapon? Nope. Can I use the thermometer as a weapon? Nope. Hmm, anything else in the crash? The strange flying machine, like nothing your eye has ever seen. You notice a plaque on it that bears the legend Maxim Maxinery Caladon. Hmm. Maybe he's the maker. Okay, Virgil, let's kill a boar. Come at me, boar. Kick, kick, kick. Critical miss damage, armor penetrated, yes. Blind, what in God's oh, shit. Better luck next time. Oh, Virgil, you healed me. How oh, nice of you. Uh, what is R? Ah, huh. Ah, now I'm ready to fight, yes. Uh, flower. Collect everything we can. Yes, more metal plates. Do I have a... Uh, what's this? Inventory? What is this? Ah, map! Uh, ah, notes. Rumors and notes. January 1st, 1885, 3 p.m. It seems as if only I have survived the crash of the IFS Zephyr. The Zeppelin was unexpectedly set upon by strange flying machines. Among the wreckage, I found the dying gnome, who gave me a signet ring and bid me to find the boy. Yes, I asked what boy. I been looking for Frodo gnome. Found it. With a vague warning of something that is almost here, he also said that he had <clears throat> expected, but I have no clue as to where he escaped from. Aha. Uh -huh. uh, rumors and notes too. After dragging myself from the wreckage of the Zeppelin crash, I was approached by a monk in of the Panarali religion. He seemed to believe that I am the living one, the reincarnation of some deity of theirs. I have found the plaque on one of the flying machines that bore a legend, Maxim Machinery Caladron. I have read this, uh, accept the discovery of... Yes, ah, quest. Mm. Kills free, good, good, good. Injured, history. See the injuries are struck out. Mm. Background. You like fire? No, you love fire. Yes, we read this. And what is this keycard? No. Uh, aha, my character page. Well, we shall deal with you in a second. Now, let's see. That was there. Don't get stuck, man. <clears throat> ah, more wolves, Virgil. Come on. Let's get ourselves wolf belts. You know, we're starting to get. <laughs> Are you blind? What in God's. I, I mean, better luck next time. Yes, Virgil, heal me. I'm starting to get. <laughs> Sun Fjord's werewolves flashbacks. Yes, kick it while it's down, kick it in the face, stupid little poor face. How is he doing on health? Ah, he's good. It reminds me of the Sunk Fjord game, we killed werewolves and wolves there. Oh, that's all. Well, might as well collect it until I reach a limit. Who knows, I can always probably sell it. Yes, wolves die. Kick, damn it! Hmm, I got stuck there for a second. Oh, what? Uh, Kite. Kite Shaman. <laughs> kick, kick, kick the wolf. What in God's I, I now kick the Shaman. Next time. No, I died! My clothes! Virgil, help, no. dammit! <laughs> I'm naked! Punch him in the face. This stupid little Kite face. Are you blind? What in God's I, I mean, better luck next time. Good job, Virgil, good job. Uh, why can't I get up, dammit? Yes, kick him while he's down. Kick him in the ass. This item's the wrong type of... What? Where did my clothes go? I'm laughing because Kite, it's a Serbian word for something. Okay, inventory. My suit is broken. <laughs> uh, what is this? 
Ha, sistem. So, let's go naked then. Ooh, chest. Uh, heals up to 100 points of poison, okay. And money. Don't mind if I do, my good sir. He was just minding his own business. We came here and murdered him and took his cash. Now, what are you? Keep the scout. Let's beat the ever living crap out of him. Yes, punch me in his little stupid face. I keep missing. Kick him, kick him, yes. <laughs> oh my god, the best way to deal with stuff. Kick it when it's down. Uh, ah, more filament, why not? Uh, nothing special about this tree. I'll take the stem as well. Yes. I don't know, it might be useful for something ghost. Might as well collect everything that can fit in my pockets. <laughs> you should be getting prey flashbacks right about now. I literally collected every little piece of the junk I could find in that game. Why'd I fell? Ah, I have spent all of this. That might be a problem. How do I regain that? Uh, what am I spending, Ghost? What is this? My stamina? He's a bit slow to recharge. Okay, for every two points I gain, I will spend one. I also collected everything. <laughs> Never know, I might need the stem for whatever. Ha! Another scout. Kick him, kick him in the face. This little stupid kid in face. <laughs> Kite scout. It's funny because the word kita in Serbian, it's the word for pee pee. And I mean for your penis. <laughs> so it's funny to me. Oh my god, how do I regain more stamina? Okay, Wolf, come to me, I'm too tired. Now, kick him. Come and get kicked. Are you blind? What in God's I I mean, better luck next time. Kick, kick, kick. Kick, 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 kick. Ah, fatigue. Yes, my stamina has been drained. How do I recover it? I mean, faster. I see that it recovers just by waiting, but we have to be on the move. <clears throat> oh wait, ah, a hidden body. Does he have loot? That's the good question. No? Really? What about you, ma'am? Ah, another part of the crash. Yes, this used to be my quarters, I guess. A gnome or something. Uh, ah, I have to be out of this mode to check that stuff. Good to know. Care, oh, wait. Where is that other body now? Huh? Dream of... Screw you. Uh, Really nothing I can collect? Fire. Fire bad. <laughs> uh, medic. Fuck off. Go. <clears throat> oh no! Bell and Tessera! Ah. We were supposed to go out, to go out later, damn it. <laughs> uh, read ah. about. Read what? Wait, I'm really. I'm dying. <laughs> Uh, on the top menu near the time bar, with the die cycle, press the dark circle and wait for an hour. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh no, wait, another scout. Another key tip. Yes, yes. Keep missing, damn it. Hit him! Hit the scout. Can I take his teeth? This item is in type of slot. Wait, what? I guess he did not have anything. Oh, she had a note. Uh, read. Damn it. Can I open it? Will he mean as note to Gerard? Mm. 
Back sound, no, no. It is that fucking note of hers. Ah, wait, it won't tell me what it says. Ah, uh ah. -huh. And they can't examine it further. Eh, never mind. <laughs> Let's get some more stamp. Who knows? Those flowers might make good tea. Ooh, wine. Oh, another wolf. Back. Yes. Kick him in his little stupid wolf face. Ah, kid. But wait. Let's first explore outside. Ooh. Yeah, whatever. Oh, another. <laughs> kick, 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 kick. I'm getting uh, <laughs> butcher flashbacks. Uh, you should be able to read it with right click in your inventory. Let's try. Ah, yes! Medir. Oh my god. Gerard. From aboard the JFC Zephyr. Speeding on my way to see you again. My breath clutches when I think that I uh, that I think. Oh my god! Wait, I have to clear out my throat. <clears> throat> I I think that in two short weeks I'll I shall be your wife. Oh, oh, too bad. That is the correct. That is correct, my dear. I am accepting your proposal. I hope thoughts of me warm your heart on your long days and nights. Guarding Vermilion's station from the half Hel Hellorks. Halorks, Halorex, Luthers. You mentioned love you always. Wilhelmina. Oh Wilhelmina, too bad. I guess he's a widower. Although he isn't. Oh, I drank it. Uh, okay. Hmm. He. He's not really a widower. He did not get married. What a tragedy. Those ogres must pay. Yes, take this as well. Hmm. Map. Map, 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 map. Uh, there's an altar over there. Uh, before we leave this area, let's check the cave. Come on, Virgil. Oh, another body. Oh, yes, he's the kite scout. You know, I see that, but I can't take that. Why? Don't save. You will regret everything. <laughs> uh, okay, before I get in the cave, I will save. Save game. New game. Number one. I know, I know, really creative. Oh no, rats! Super rat! Uh, Virgil? Are you blind? What in God's eye? Just I mean, better luck him. next time! For fuck's Are sakes. you blind? What in God's eye? I mean, better luck next time! No, Virgil, don't die! Virgil, move, damn it! Can I kick you? Really, Virgil almost got murdered by rats. Uh, junk fire. Oh, arrows. I shall take. Uh, salt, salt pepper. Yeah, might take as well. Game. I need a suit. I need a weapon. Oh wait. Aha. Uh -huh. uh, broken tip of pistol. Uh, a tigre sword. Ooh. Virgil. Oh no, it's just a ratman. Uh, what are these? Railroad spikes. Uh, healing. Lesser wound, okay. Small metal tube. And filament. Can I actually equip any of this? I don't use it as a. I can! Uh, but not in both hands. <laughs> Maybe the pipe? Okay, okay. There's nothing in there. I will save. I will save before entering every area. Okay, my little ratish friend, let's see how you like railroad spike in the face. If only I could hit a rat. 
Uh, critical miss. Yes, yeah, stab it. Uh, here, there is nothing, huh? Well, I can't loot the rats. Uh, migration. Hell, lesser wounds. All. Iron ore, iron ore. Oh no! Oh, ghost! Ghost, it's you! <laughs> Hello, please help me. How? How do I help you? No, wrong button. Yes. The spirit appears to be in great pain. Please, I beg you. The pain. What happened to you? I must take my leave. <laughs> I was cursed by evil priest. My name was Charles Brecho. My friend, and I asked only for something to eat. Some sustenance. We were poor, wandering. And he cursed us, my friend. Cursed with madness. Attacked me, killed me, the pain. I curse to be held to this realm, unable to release. Please, I need your help, or I will haunt you. It's a bad ghost, uh, but it's, it's red. Yes, I guess you're right. What is that you would have me do? I don't know. Why should I? Uh, let's not antagonize the spirit. I don't want to be haunted. <coughs> Need to kill priest. Abrolach, he lives here. He points to your map. Only his death will free me. I don't know, killing a priest might not be the best idea. I don't know. What do you give me for doing this? Of course, of course, justice must prevail. Hmm, what does he offer? I know of treasure. Buried for years. Uh, no. Every ghost is dead. Ah. Please hurry release me from my pain. Uh, this spirit appears to be in great pain. Please I beg pain. But listen, you want me to kill him. Kill a priest. Oh, I can sleep. Sleep for an hour. Sleep for two hours. Sleep for... Let's, let's have a nap. One hour, okay. Getting your old pistol. Mm. Dynamite as well. Don't mind if I do. What is this? Stun grenade. Uh, explosive grenade. Dark hold. Bullets 15. Yes. Yes. Hmm. Revolver chamber. Stun grenade. Old flintlock pistol, but it works. Yes. Did you have any clothes? Can I take the clothes off your body, sir? I'm not sure about killing the priest, depends. We shall see. Uh, nothing in this barrel. Let's arm ourselves now. Uh, but wait, I don't really want to waste my weapons. Total attack. <coughs> uh, let's just use the rail railroad, railroad spike for now. Hmm. Yes, there is a game like this one that I used to play. You can't loot spirits, unfortunately. I just want to loot his body. Uh, what's the name? Damn it. Throne of Darkness. You would like it really much. But there is a lot less talking and mostly running around and killing everything. Yeah, but they seem to be well rested. Which is good. Virgil, I need some pants, man. Do you happen to have an extra pair? Uh, this shrine before the you altar should clear things up for us a bit. Hmm. It says, uh, you can look. and the spirit of Nazardin shall be reborn on wings of fire in hills shrouded in fog, and fight the last battle with the evil one. And the evil one? Who is that? <sighs> I'm sorry, but I don't know. <laughs> I guess we better find out, considering you're supposed to fight him. <laughs> really, me? I'm glad you find this amusing, because I don't at all. That's probably a good idea, Virgil, let's go. Uh, whatever. This gets more ridiculous as we go along. He is right. I know you might not believe in all this, but I do. Might you show me a little more respect? Alright, I'm sorry, Virgil. You can't leave whenever you feel the urge to do so. 
All right. Sorry, Virgil. Let's yes, just go. Of course. I should respect your beliefs. Yeah, I mean, you did help me. Ooh. May, should I stab you? Oh, there. What are you doing up here? What oh, damn, man. I just revived the blazing inferno. Who are you? Who asked? What are you doing here? I just saw the accident. I ran up here as fast as I could. Let's... Let's be. I mean no disrespect, to, sir, but yes? I don't trust this bastard one bit. Bloody convenient he just happened to show up here just now, don't you think? Hmm. Oh, excuse my language, uh, sir. You might have a point, Virgil, but he might just have been out for a walk. What do you recommend, Virgil? I've uh, dealt with buggers, uh, <laughs> individuals like this before. Perhaps you'll let me talk with him for a few minutes. Hmm. Listen, Virgil, I do the talking. I'll hear no more of it. Of course, Virgil, I feel free to do what you think is best. Yes. Thank you. Uh, I'll take care of this. Okay. <clears throat> you there! What exactly are you doing up here? And what gives you the right to ask so many questions? The man just witnessed the Zeppelin crash. Virgil, god damn it. I'm just asking a simple question. What are you two doing up here? I'm from Shrouded Hills, a village not far from here. And I witnessed this terrible accident. It's such a crime to wonder what exactly is going on. Uh, Virgil, I think you have spoken enough. This man gives Virgil a hard look, <laughs> then turns to you, <laughs> nodding. Yes, that's more reasonable. Now, why are you here? As I've said, I've just survived this blimp crash. It seems I'm the only survivor from the crash of the Eiffel Zephyr. Perhaps you ought to tell me what you're doing here. He already did. <laughs> I saw there was a distance and came to investigate. Then you were on the IFS Zephyr and survived. Did you happen to see a gnome? His name was Preston Radcliffe. How would he know about the gnome? Yes, he's laying just over there. Spoke with him before he died. Mm, why are you so curious about the whole affair? He knows too much! Poor Virgil, already enduring abuse from the main character. He's not! He, he was just an asshole to this guy! He, to be honest, we just met him, but he knows a bit too much. I don't feel like speaking about it, leave me alone. Yes, why are you curious about the whole affair? I am from Shrouded Hills, a town not far from here. I saw the crash and came here. But yes, but you know the gnome, how do you know the gnome? I did see a gnome. He's lying just over there. I don't feel like speaking about it. Uh, let's tell him just to go invest in, investigate the gnome. Did you say anything to you before he died? Yes, he gave me a ring. <laughs> no? Why are you so curious about the whole affair? I don't feel like speaking. We shall end the conversation. I'm afraid that's not an option here. You see, I'm here to see if there were any survivors. Aha! Well, my good sir, I'm packing. As I told you, I'm a survivor. Uh, just here to see what happened. I don't like your turn, sir. Get out of my way. <coughs> He's here to clean up the mess. Let's tell him we survived. Oh, fuck. Inventory. Go. I'm going to regret this, damn it. Switch. Uh, no, no, no. Shoot him in the face. Are you blind? Are you blind? What Critical God, miss. Like well, might as well waste all of my ammo. Virgil, protect me, damn it! Uh, can we just punch him? Oh my God, I'm dead! Stop! Damn it! Stop! Spike him! Spike him before he kills Virgil, damn it! Oh my god, you're dead. <laughs> okay, Ghost, I see now. I see. You were right. <laughs> I'm sorry, Virgil. I'm sorry. But I did not expect to miss every goddamn shot. I should have saved after I left the cave. Now we get to kill the rats again.
and I can't even hit the damn rats. Oh, Virgil, don't die to them, damn it. Nice one, Virgil, nice one. Okay, ghost. Uh... Oh, gosh. Okay, for doing this, yes, the little test finished. That's what I said. God damn it, why am I so bad with the pistol? I couldn't manage one shot. Ah, I know why. I know what's the problem. Lack of experience. And the fact that I should have made the game turn-based. Might have ended things better. <laughs> God damn it, we got our ass kicked. Oh Virgil, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I doubted you, my friend. And my inventory is full. Hmm. That's not gonna cut it. Hmm. Long grenade, explosive grenade. It might be too close. I might hit Virgil damn it. Maybe if you're gonna flamethrower anyone, you can upgrade your firearms and P. You have one point. That is actually true. Thank you, Ghost. Thank you. Uh <clears throat> now where is it? Bow, dodge, melee, throwing. Uh, oh my god. No, this is for magic. I need... Can craft a thin clock, broken, small melee. Is this for crafting? Uh, intelligence. I am lacking in the intelligence department, that's true. Hmm, where is it, damn it. Gunsmithy layman, no. Repair, ah, firearms. This is what I should have got, damn it. No wonder I could not hit him, I was inefficient with my skill. Okay, let's get an hour of sleep, like last time. And this time we actually might do better. Yes. Okay, let's be smart about this, let's save. Save too. <laughs> Maybe until I get a, a use to use use to things, I should set it to turn base. Yeah, let's try it like that. Mm, nothing here. I was killing the Kita with no problem, so I fought one dude. Isn't going to cause too much trouble, but it did. Oh wait, my inventory is full, god damn it. I'll take the gun again. Hopefully. We have many debuffs for some reason. Uh, I might be tired. The altar should clear things up for us a bit. Why did my music doesn't... I'm go. sorry, but I don't know. Yeah, Virgil would... <laughs> I guess we better find out. Considering yes. you're supposed to fight him. Yes, of course. Oh, Virgil. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Love books, character editor. Ah, it's because I was tired. That's why I had the, the debuffs. Okay, Virgil. We shall say the same things again. But... Good God, man, I just tried the blazing it. I mean yes. no disrespect to... I've dealt. Uh, thank you. Uh, Three. Uh, Listen. Virgil, I'll handle this from now on. Uh, I said just survive the blink crash. Please only survive from the crash. Perhaps tell me you are doing here. I don't trust you. I sold you. I'm a survivor. Wait. Ah, turn base. Good. He stopped. Now. If I try to move here, then shoot. Aha, uh -huh, we hit him. 
shoot me, Virgil hit him, shoot me, missed. Damn it, Nor Damn it, Virgil! Okay, we are actually hitting him this time. Little for miss. Oh my god, I'm going to waste all of my bullets. Okay, let's try one more time. Hopefully it will hit. Ah, got him. Hmm, expected more damage. Let's change my gun for a regular spike. I have no room. Uh, must rearrange stuff, okay. Now let's stab him with this. Ah, oh, did I manage to stab myself? Get up! I know I ran out of the thing. Yes, Virgil, hit him, hit him, kill him! Good job, Virgil, good job. <laughs> I'm sorry I doubted you. I'm sorry I doubted you. So, you had nothing, but you managed to kick her ass. Okay. Elf City Dweller, ah. Goddamn liar. Oh yes, the fatigue. Uh, hmm. Okay, let's change back to real time. This is not working as intended. Oh my god, Virgil, I need a rest. Can I sleep on the ground for an hour, huh? Sleep for an... Sleep for... Let's... Yeah, let's sleep for four hours. Good. Uh, click on the same icon below the window close if you get what I mean. When you loot him. Uh, he had nothing. But we oh. have wounds. <coughs> Kill the wolf. Kill it! It seriously hurts! Are you blind? What in God's... I, I mean, better luck next time! <laughs> oh my god, Virgil, you died. You appear to have a problem. Can I... Is Virgil dead? Can I revive him or something? <laughs> oh my god. Yes, he dies of fatigue. Let's stab you first. Oh my god, I'm doing nothing to them. At least I can run. Yes, yeah, stand here. Avoid him. Let's get to Virgil as soon as possible. Eat his corpse! Eat his corpse! Leave me alone! <laughs> Virgil, Virgil, I'm back. No, he's dead. He's dead, dead, right? When you loot him. Mm. Aha, I see. Uh, <laughs> Ghost, I need a bit of help. Is there any way to help Virgil or is he done for? Is he dead dead? <laughs> Completely dead. Oh, Virgil. What do I do, damn it? <laughs> uh, let's reload. <laughs> Again. I can't lose Virgil. can do anything with what you have. Sadly, I know... At least I know that I can steal the clothes of the man. I can stun the wolves and we can well run past them, I guess. The altar should clear... I'm sorry. I oh, know sorry, this is all a bit much, considering what you've just been through. Let's just get to Shrouded <laughs> Hills. Okay, you're having a bit of a problem issue. 
let's go back turn based options fast turn base turn base fast turn base done good day my good sir <clears throat> I mean no I've uh, dealt with buggers uh thank you Are you blind? What in God's I I mean better luck next time. Oh my god, his punches they hurt. And I keep missing yeah. every hit. You know, you remember saying something about making a trash character? I think I might just hit on that. Are you blind? Critical what in miss, God's damage, I, I mean, best better luck next time. Oh. <sighs> the pain. Really? <laughs> get up, damn it, get up! Well, we're dead. <laughs> For fuck's sake! <laughs> okay, let's try again. Fast turn base, turn base, done. I'll take my gun. Hopefully, I'll be able to hit him. Oh wait, did we go the wrong way? No. I have to save the stun grenade for the wolves. I'm sorry. The altar should clear I'm things sorry. up for us a bit. Hmm. Yes, of course. Hmm. Wait, what do you have in your inventory, my good friend? What is it that you want of me? Hmm. Thank you, question. Could you heal me? I would like to make a trade. You have nothing that we can use. Although I could take your cloak. I have an idea. Let's sleep until morning. Maybe in daylight we'll have better luck. And now I'm rested. Yes, my good sir. Come. I mean no disrespect. I've uh -huh. dealt with buggers. Thank you. Eh, yeah, whatever. Just fight us. Shoot. Oh, we hit him. Oh my god, but we do such little damage to him. If I change position, will I have a better chance to keep? Maybe if I move here, 27%. Maybe if I move behind him, it's 10%. Uh. And bullets. I keep missing, damn it. <laughs> well, not everything is lost. Well, I have learned one thing trust Virgil. Oh my god, get up, get up! Virgil, save me, kill him, damn it! Get up! Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah! Well, we're all dead, good. <laughs> Did he hit himself? Oh my god, Virgil, no! Not again! Is there nothing I can do to help him, damn it? Uh, being with firearm sucks. I agree. Oh, he had the medallion as the orcs. But we have to reload because we lost Virgil, which is a problem. If I lose him now... I might have a better chance to hit him with 12. With the spike, which is sad to say. But what can one do? Maybe if I stab him in the face enough. Although I do have this to heal myself, so Virgil. Uh, what is this? 
migraine cure nope <laughs> dynamite for the wolves might be a good idea the thermometer Okay, Virgil, I shall sleep. What? We shall wait here until morning. Yeah, let's sleep eight hours. The altar should clear. Yes, of course. Yes, yes, yes. yes. <laughs> I'm well rested, so. I mean no disrespect. I've uh, thank you. Well, Are you blind? What in God's I I mean better luck next time. Let me this time myself. Although I'm doing more stuff with the spike than with just the, with the pistol. Protect Virgil, protect Virgil, god damn it. If I run around, will he follow me? Will Virgil get up? <laughs> but I will burn all of my stamina, which is not good. Stab, run, stab, run. <laughs> Virgil, if you don't mind, my good sir, get up. <sighs> yes! Virgil! Kill me, man! <laughs> Well, he chases me. <laughs> yes, now! Well, he's down. Stab, stab him, stab him, stab him good. Oh, thank God. This man was a hired killer. Someone doesn't want anyone walking away from this blimp crash. Yes, it seems that way. Perhaps it has to do with the gnome. Hmm. Yes, that may very well be the case. It might be a good idea to find out who owns that ring. Maybe I shouldn't wear it in public. Yeah, who cares? Perhaps there will be some answers in Shrouded Hills. Yes, let's go to Shrouded Hills. Okay, Virgil, first of all, I'm sorry I ever doubted you. You just saved my life, my good man. Thank you for it. Uh, inventory. For the wolves, we shall try dynamite. These items. Wait, stones. Wait, what? God damn it, I dropped it. No, what did they do with it? Really? Did, did they really do that? I blew myself up. Oh, ho, 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 ho. So pre uh, pressing right click and leaving on the dynamite will well, leave the dynamite to explode. Good to know, good to know. Well, we're back here again. Let's still take the spike. Yes, well, the right. altar should clear things up for us. A yes, of course. <laughs> yes, let's sleep. Now. Let's stab the man again. I'm I've uh, thank you. Blah blah blah. Step, step, step. Blind? What in God's I I mean, better luck next time. Yes. Virgil! I'm stuck, Virgil. For fuck's sake, I'm stuck. <laughs> kill him. Before he kills me. Are you blind? What in God's I I mean, better luck next time. Yes, now, when he's down. Stab, stab. In his heart. His evil heart. This man was a hired killer. Hmm. Yes. Let's go to Shrouded Hills. <laughs> Okay, before I blow myself up again, let's save. 
Now, what did you have on you, sir? Just the medallion. I start to think wearing that medallion might be a problem. What is it that you want of me? I need what healing. type of healing do you want? What Magical. type of healing do you want? Yeah. I am finished. What is it that you want of me? What yes. type of what type of yeah. I am finished. What is it that what type what type of yeah. I am finished. <laughs> oh my god, he fell over. Yes, you are. Thank you, Virgil. Thank you. Ah, he's tired. Well, after that bit of murder, let's rest for an hour. Ah, now I know how to refill this. Okay, wait, wait. I want this close. Uh, no, open to loot, damn it. Virgil. What is it that you want of me? Let's trade. Have my old suit. And... Uh, how, about, how about I give you the medallion as well? Yeah, there you go. Are you wearing it? <laughs> yes, he is. Now, I would like to loot his remains again. I can't. Why? I need his clothes, damn it, I'm naked. Oh, it's good. Now, the wolves. Should use the stun grenade. At least try to use it. Hopefully to better effect. No? I can't. What about the explosive one? No? This is the wrong type of that slot. In which slot does it go? Hmm, this may be a problem. What if I try to shoot the wolves? Or even better, what if I try to avoid them? Uh, save. Save free. Hmm, what's this? Huh. Okay, Virgil, we might have a problem. The big wolf. The small wolf. If I kill the, sm <coughs> if I kill the small ones first, it will be less damage. Can we hit him? Yes. Now the other one. Shoot. Kill. Virgil. No, Virgil. Seriously hurt, sir. I know, Virgil. Please help me. I will. I mean, he died again. Oh, and there's another. Well, we never survived the crash. Uh, Virgil, can I tell you to stay somewhere else? Hmm? If I was to run in there, plant dynamite, that might solve our wolf problem. Problem solving. <laughs> One encounter at a time. No, but if I right click on it, it opens the wrong type for that slot. In which slot does it go, damn it? How they use the sun grenade? Uh, sword, please. Hmm. How much stones? Ooh, 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 this might be a problem. Really want to go the hard way. Is there another way to go? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but I did not check the map, that is true. <laughs> not like this is helpful. Oh wait, I can... <laughs> I can quick travel! <laughs> 
Well done, well done. Really, I could have done that. Ooh, world icon on top. Ah, but now it just feels like cheating. <laughs> like I cheated. Uh, okay, where do we go from here? <laughs> well, proceed. East to north. Northeast. <laughs> Until we reach something. Northwest. Wait, how do yeah. That's a better question. Yes, take me there. Aha! So I don't have to go on foot everywhere. It's still like cheating when you realize how large the map is. Well, I should have killed the wolves. This Heston is exquisitely carved with uh, this message. Jamil, beloved wife of Mater. Mm. This Heston is exquisitely carved with this message. Son. Knock knock. Good day. Uh, why do you have blood on your floor? Sir, your dress. By all that's holy, cover yourself. I would, but I don't have anything to wear. <laughs> I don't believe I had the pleasure. Who are you? <laughs> this uh, this and old priest seems to be in some pain. I am Abarach. He winces. And you are... Oh wait, this is the... <laughs> this is the priest you're supposed to kill. Okay, let's 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 not tell him what you're here to do at first. Maybe we won't kill him, but the blood here. That's a good thing to ask about. Well, Kiselina, what brings you to my humble farm? I've been sent here by beggar spirit. I simply traveling about. What happened to you? My family was brutally slaughtered by two madmen, Regor and Parkus. I believe their names were. I was left for dead. I welcomed them into my home, <laughs> offered them sustenance, and they r raped my. repaid me. <laughs> I was about to read. The <laughs> I was about to read that they raped me. <laughs> I was like, what? They repaid me by killing my wife and children, and stealing the only thing I had of any value: secret religious artifact. Aha, so the ghost was a bandit. Bad ghost, bad ghost. I met the spirit of one of those killers. I'm not interested in hearing your lies, dog. Prepare to die. Well, he's a priest. Why would he lie? One of them is dead already. I shouldn't be surprised. Probably killed by the other. I would assume dreadful evil people they ever. Bradka told me your curse made his friend turn on him. No, I believe that was the curse of greed. Their souls will never leave this plane of existence, but that was the only curse I put on them. <laughs> ah, if I had to guess, Parker decided he didn't want to share the ill-gotten gains with anyone. I said, they were truly evil individuals. I'm sorry for your loss. <laughs> that was a great story, I need to kill you now. I will go now. I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you for your kind words, but there is something else I need to recover. The sacred artifact they, were, they stole. It's very important to me, I need it to pray to my gods efficiently. Did Preho say anything, give any clue as to where it might be? No, he did not. Uh, he hobbles a bit closer to you. I know it's none of your affair, but could you assist me in trying to locate what is rightfully mine? Is the least I could do? Any idea where I should start? That depends on what would you <laughs> worth to you. You're right, it is none of my affair, good day. I'm sorry my for your loss, but I have more precious concerns. Let's help the priest. Excellent, perhaps our friend as friend, the late Mr. Brecho, would have some information he could import impart to you, regardless of the location of my sacred possession. He smiles at you warmly. I appreciate your kindness, though I regret I have nothing to give you for your help. Well, a set of clothes would be nice. 
but it's okay. I will return when I have retrieved your property, sir. Yeah, not sure how that's going to happen. Ah, so they killed his wife and son. Child, so they're buried there. Are there fresh grapes? Hmm. Wait, ghost, if I don't use the circle, I have to walk everywhere on foot, huh? Hmm. Ah, this is what happened so far. Yeah, let's use the circle. Crash site. Abel's house. Let's go to the hills. I would walk all the way there, but I need some clothes or something. Hello, Joaquim is staying at the inn next to the bank. Mm -hmm. uh, get your clothes on. I just been the most terrible blink crash. <laughs> Might I ask? <laughs> terrible blink. I this this is hilarious to me. Just been the terrible blink crash. I was in the Hindenburg, my good sir. Might I ask who you are, sir? Let's cry about our dream crash. Good God! You mean the IF has a fear? I thought it. I'd heard something in the night. Where did this happen? Just up the hill. I recommend you bring the coroner. <laughs> oh no! What about the local surgeon? Are there any other survivors? No. Seems luck has favored only myself. Uh, perhaps. You have to check the site yourself. <laughs> of course, of course, right away. And you've come to the right man, being the local constable. Oh, he is an officer. I will fall on. Uh, it will fall on to me to take action. I'll call the volunteers immediately. Good, good, good idea. One or two more questions. Of course, go ahead. What can you tell me about this place? <clears throat> Do you know anything about the altar of mountains? Can you tell me anything about this thing? Tell me about the place. Surely, this is. Shrouded hills, a mining town. <clears throat> oh my god. Through and through. As far as towns go, it's pretty old, but we've got most of what, what a soul might need. Do you have any clothes? What sort of mining goes around here? Ore mining mostly, and not even so much of that anymore. Years ago, the old basy stone silver mine brought quite a bit of business to Shrouded Hills. The vein ran dry. And so did most of the local commerce. All that comes up out of old Bessie now is iron ore. Hmm, sometimes you can use paid transport, but those that is expensive. We shall see. I am not quite rich. <laughs> 418 gold. There is also a ton silver mine. Well, it's just west of the town and then a bit north. People don't go out there much anymore. Shrouded hills, folk always were a bit sus sus superstitious about old Bessie. What is that? Just... Who was Bessie Tone? Bessie Tone, she was an old woman, used to live here in town, owned the silver mine. Really strange, old lady. Strange how? Well, folks say she never slept, and she'd make shepherd's pie out of screws. Typical towny talk. Someone said old Zeph... Zeph? Yetz? Backside broke out in boils when he sat on her divan. Divan. <laughs> I get the picture. Is that all? No. When the main started to dry up, I guess the. <sighs> I, I need a glass of water. No, when the main started to dry up, I guess she really got Betty. Went up there one day, fired all of the workers, and walked down into the mines. Word has it, she was never seen again. It is a bit odd. Who owns the mine now? I'm not sure. I suppose it's owned by her son now, Percival Tone. My thanks. Where does Percival Tone live? Oh, he lives up to the main. You can't miss it. Uh, mm, do you know anything about the altar of mountains? <laughs> Strange business, that. <clears throat> belongs to the local religious types. A group called the Panale, Panrali. Yes, Virgil's group. 
seems they think something strange is going to happen around here. So they're always going up there to wait for it. What exactly do these Parali believe in? His eyes... <laughs> he eyes Virgil. Seems to notice him for the first time. I think your Parali companion there would know a lot more about it. Why do you ask? Why don't you ask him? <laughs> Thank you, Matthias. Another question. Uh, what can you tell me about this place? Can you tell me anything about this thing? Who's in charge around here? Well, I sort of double as a constable and the town's mayor. I suppose you could say I'm the man to see. Hmm. What sort of businesses are here in the town? Oh, the usual things. A blacksmith, a general store, a inn, a big pub. You're looking for some healing, old Doc Roberts can help you. He's just north of here. Very good. What sort of... Hmm... What could you say out of here? Yes, well, that's a sticky situation. You see, there's only one bridge to the east of town. And currently, that very bridge is being held by a group of thieves. Please continue. <laughs> I have to use different voices <laughs> for me and him. <clears throat> okay, he's grey, he's old. Uh, we believe another bridge further down the river, but these thieves are making anyone who crosses the bridge pay a heavy toll. Needless to say, the locals aren't happy. Why haven't you done anything about this, Constable? Uh, well, I... Uh, I've been very busy with other problems. Uh, of course, I plan to take care of them as soon as, po soon as humanly possible. I'm sure you were busy. Perhaps I could help. Who exactly are those thieves? Oh, just some brigands. Go we'll blow into town. I'll uh, dispatch them uh, tomorrow, right? After I take care of them uh, other business. I'm sure you're very busy. Perhaps I could help. You might be more successful if you stop quivering. <laughs> Let's not antagonize the man. Really? Oh, I mean, uh, not that I need it. Uh, you seem fit for the job. Always, though, about getting a deputy. Sure, if you're willing, I suppose, I can give you a chance. Oh, I'll be honored to remove them. What's the pay? <laughs> Splendid. And it's our secret that you lack the backbone. <laughs> Let's not be an asshole to the sheriff. <laughs> You're an amateur, but I suppose I could see my way to paying you 50 gold pieces for the job? Done. Uh, it's at your salary, I mean, I'm doing your job. An interesting offer, I consider it. One thing more. Can I get more? <laughs> should, I, should, I, should I ask for more? Uh, what? You're insulting me? Well, yes. <laughs> I have no need of this from you, the likes of you. Your pathetic disgrace. Back to the badge. <laughs> disgrace to the badge. Just joking, old chap. If I remove them, what's the pay? Ah, only playing with you. Who are these degenerates? <laughs> this sounds like something I would say. Just to bring us who blew up. Found okay, we heard that. Might more successful though. Perhaps I could help. What's the pay? 50. An interesting offer, I'll consider it one thing more. Yes. I have something you need to tell you. Well, he's the sheriff. Uh, what is it? Nothing really. Hmm. <laughs> You're ill dressed for our town. I apologize, my present thank you, sir. Uh, is the town constable? I've got a lot of. But I just plan not like you. Hmm. There are no changes in your mind. Goodbye. I had enough of your babbling. Up with your fists. <laughs> I could have a moment. Thank you, sir. Okay, goodbye. Uh, where can I get close, damn it? Virgil. What is it that you want of me? I would like to make a trade. I cannot wear my broken suit, can I? What is it that uh, you want of me? I have a few more questions. I'd like to do something for me, Virgil. Hmm. 
I need healing. What can I answer for you? A few things about you, Virgil. Yes, tell me about yourself, Virgil, while we're here. Oh yes, I forgot. What is it that you want of me? What can I answer for you? Yeah. What do you know about this place? Hmm. I think we should do two things. We should try and find the Elder Joachim, and then find out who the owner of that ring is. What is it that you want of me? What can I answer for you? What do you know about this place, Virgil? This is Shrouded Hills. There's an old Panari temple here. The Elder Joachim told me that it was once a very important place to the Panari. I don't know much else about the place beyond that. Hmm, I see. Well, there is the inn, damn it. There is the map. I was taken by strange man, the trash site. Uh, does it say what, what build... What? Ah, uh -huh. I see. The inn must be here. But maybe I should go to the general store and well get myself some clothes. I can't go everywhere naked. Uh, good day, ma'am. Hello, welcome to the bank. Aha, uh -huh. how can I help you today? You see, the bank doesn't mind that I don't have clothes. They just are interested in the money. With nothing, my good ma'am. Yeah, let's go to the inn. What can one do? I hope it does not have a dress code. Uh, innkeeper. Joaquim's room is at the end of the hall on the left. Maybe he has some clothes we can borrow. Bed, bed. Shoes! I shall take. Money! I shall borrow. <laughs> Virgil. Enter the hole to the left. Well... Might as well get some shoes. <laughs> mm, nothing else we can check, huh? Now oh, we can have a rest. Hmm, is this door locked? Probably. <sighs> They're dead! How for bandit, uh, human villager. Oh my god, my good sir. God damn it. Why are you naked? <sighs> yeah, for, half for bandit had nothing except the necklace. Good god! What's happened here? These men, I, I've never seen them before. Virgil, they came to kill the... Well, your priest. Uh, Joachim's letter, yes. Uh, read. Oh, Virgil, I assume you are not alone. As you can see, there are people in shrouded hills looking for me. Luckily... Luckily for me, these fellows were easily dispatched. Do not speak with Sorry anyone. Sorry to interrupt, but it seems Joachim has discovered something. These individuals seem to be part of some larger plot. A Virgil, plot I, I against know against you. Hmm. It looks that way. Tell me, Virgil, who exactly is this Joachim? He is... Well... Someone who helped me out when I needed it. I met him in a small village at a Panari temple. I was, uh, a bit down on my luck. He showed me that you don't always have to take what life gives you. That there's always a better path. And that it's always your choice to travel it. Yes, he is right. What do you mean, down on your luck? What happened? I I'd rather not talk about it anymore. But Joachim is a great man. Well versed in the ways of the Panari, <coughs> and also in the ways of the world. If he thinks we're in trouble, then we are. Let's get out of here, and get to Tarant. Alright Virgil, perhaps we'll talk more of this later. The summons lost in tongue. Now, let's get back to that letter, dammit. No, E. Hmm... Where is the dispatch? Do not speak without the Zeppelin crash. <laughs> or your new companion's involvement with it. When you are able to, make your way to Tarant, check the telegram of mine office there. 
I will leave a message telling you where to contact me. Joachim. Oh my god, Joachim, please tell me you left some clothes. No, just money. How much money? 20. Yeah. Hmm, anything else we can loot? Damn it. No. Well, that's unfortunate. I put door locked. Can't really lock me, can I? Uh, innkeeper, good day. Be very close around here, sir. <laughs> Greetings, good sir. What can I help you with? I would like to room for the night. I will be in town for a while, would like to room for the week. Can you tell me about this ring? Uh, let's not tell him about the ring. Okay, where is the general store? Excuse me, sir. Sir, attention to your dress at once. Hello, sir. May I ask some questions? <laughs> yes, what is it? I would like to receive apprentice training. Ah. Uh, sadly, not now. I need a pair of pants. She ran about undress, so. I believe it now. Goodbye. Where is the general store, damn it? Oh my god, rats. What is it that you want of me? No! Virgil! Kill the rats, kill the rats. Are you blind? What in God's I I mean better luck next time. Uh, Virgil, what do you drop to speak? Uh. Are you blind? What in God's I I mean better luck next time? I keep hitting myself. I think. A critical miss ends up in a me hitting me. So you drop your stick. I can't carry. Uh, Virgil, why did you drop your stick, damn it? Hmm. Can I <sighs> drink the one? Uh, sort, sort, yes, sort. How much room do I need for it? That's a better question. Probably more than I have. Now can I pick it up? Really, it has disappeared. Ah, you broke your stick. Oh my god, Virgil. What is it that you want of uh, me? Uh, small trade. You have a spike. Why don't you use it, damn it, man? You have a stick as well. Hmm. Okay, Virgil. Okay. Ammonia. Magnesium. The back leaves. So, hmm. can I take one of these cans as well? Yes, sort of name for it, please. Yeah, you never know. We might need for something. Uh, when you drink wine, you strength increases. Ah, good to know. Hmm, can I take the lantern? What is it that you want of me? No, Virgil, I must be off. Uh, this I cannot check. I can check the bed. Kill the rats. Okay, this one is attacking us. Let's kill it first. Because this one seems to be dead. Are you blind? What in God's I I mean, better luck next time! Did the rat just stun me? Get the rat, get the rat! Thank you, Virgil. Ooh, oil barrels. Who are you, my good sir? Hmm, you like my steam, but he's... Dwarf... Technologist. <coughs> okay, we need a dwarf voice. 
I <coughs> wait. I need a deeper voice. I you like my steam engine? It's mine. I keep it clean. I run good. Ah yes, very pretty. Yeah, very nice. I must be going. Ah yes, yes, a shiny sea. I like steam. Steam is hot. Makes funny noise. And you say. And you say you take care of this thing. I good with machine. I fix good. I like my steam engine. It's shiny. I see. Well, it has been incredibly stimulating, but I must be go. But I must be go. I must. I must beg my leave. Oh my god. I don't know what's worse. My English or my dwarf accent that did not sound like a dwarf. Hmm. Well, we stole his ammoniac. That's something. Where is the general store? Can I sell my shit? Uh, map. Map, please help. Nope. Map. Aha, I can set waypoints. But that's not what I want to do. Ha! Huh. This must be the general store. Uh, how very odd, you lack of clothing. <laughs> oh, how very odd, your lack of clothing, sir. Th that is. Sir, we just met. And already such harsh words. <laughs> Rizia is a good man, but something about you gets under Rizia's skin. Be gone with you. Please, let's try to work this out. <laughs> You're going to pay dearly for that. I see there's no chance. Change your mind, goodbye. Eh. Eh, perhaps. You're still rather revolting, although maybe in a way you just can't help. I will fucking stab you. I'm trying my very hardest to impress you. You're <clears throat> Your entrails will most definitely be a revolting sight. <sighs> I'm looking for the general store. I don't think this is the general store. But let's 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 be nice. Oh, all right. You've won me over. Perhaps you're toler tolerable. Yes, I'm very glad. May I ask who you are? I'm Rizessa, importer of fine goods and uh, rarities from all over the world. Nowhere will you find more incredible assortment of fantastical oddities from the four corners of Arcanum and beyond. You're looking for something special, yes? Uh, no, really, just change... Uh, just chance to stop by. Fascinating, could you answer a few questions? What can Rizia do for you? Actually, I have a uh, What could you tell me about this thing? Can I look at your trade goods? Yes! Okay, he has a pistol, a shovel. Uh, I suppose two coins. That's my offer. <sighs> oh, he doesn't want the stem. Filament. Oh, not interesting. Hmm. Ooh! Ooh, but the camera it will fetch a good price. I do I want to sell it? Okay, let's sell the railroad spikes. I don't... He doesn't want. <sighs> Metal plating, at least. Steel. I feel like a gypsy selling second-hand. You know, old metal, scrap metal. I would like to go first somewhere and buy some clothes, if you don't mind, but... Okay, let's sort the inventory out. Let's sell what he wants. I will always get more, I guess. Uh, yes, take the ammonia, take the piece. I can buy it back for 13 coins. <laughs> uh, we shall sell everything that we don't have a duplicate of. So you don't want the stem. Don't want this. Three coins. Filament, what is it used for, damn it? Yeah, we shall see. We shall leave one just in case we need it. Sell. Yes, sell. Mm, we can steal another. 
uh, small metal tube, we might use it to make a blunderbuster um, dynamite. 69 coins, might blow myself up again. Uh, might need it. Yes, take the medallions, we have plenty. Mm, metal plate he does not want, charcoal he does not want, thermometer, no matches, no, 20 coins, no, I might need that, two pack of leaves, take, I should leave myself with one, uh, what's this, salt, pepper, yeah, leave one just in case, grenades I will keep, revolver thing I will keep, cylinder, mm, keep, 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 is this coal? He doesn't want the flower. He wants the spring. Take, take. With filament, you can make a lantern if you are good with electricity. I'm not. So far, it's just junk in my pocket. Hmm. Hmm. Now we have opened some inventory space. Let's not sell everything. We might need stuff for well stuff. Do you have clothes, my good man? Well he says shovel. 54 coins. Gun parts. He can send me back my tobacco, my medallion for 27. No thanks. Okay, Riza, see you. I have to find clothes, damn it. Blacksmith, please. Tell me you have clothes. Oh, Recrip. Oh, Recrip. Oh my god. Oh, reprehensible man. You have done my heart no good, sir, with your poor state of dress. Oh ho ho. Might I ask who you are, sir? Greetings, I am Lloyd Gurgles. Gurlues, the local blacksmith. How might I help you today? A pleasure, Lloyd. Might I ask you for a few questions? Oh. How can I help? What service do you provide, Lloyd? What service? What are you in need of? Well, I need clothes. Can you train to be an apprentice? Uh, shall we... Shall we... Barter, sir? Any rumors from trade routes? Yes. <clears throat> I can assist you for 12 coins. Uh, certainly not. Uh, is there anything else? May I ask some questions? Hmm. Uh, how has business been lately? Business? Oh, I suppose it's never outstanding here in Shrouded Hills. We're a small town and a sim simple folk, but to be honest, I've had trouble getting my hands on any good ore. Ore that I just sold. Ore for smithing. It's hard to bring up anything out of the old Bussy Tone. What's the old Bussy Tone? The Bussy Tone is an old silver mine, just north and little west of town. There hasn't been silver down there for a long time, but we'll still bring up some iron or every once in a while. Worthless though, as long as Bessie is wandering here. As long as Bessie is wandering her mind. What who is the Bessie? Bessie Tone? Lloyd Wink winks at you. <laughs> wink wink. Well I could tell you who was who she was. But I'm not good at spinning yarns. If you really want to know about old Bessie, you should talk to her son, Percival. He lives up there, near the mine. I see. What type of ore do you need, Lloyd? Well, sir, I'm in a dire need of some pure ore. I'll... <clears throat> God damn it. I'll not make a blade without it. If you could find, me, <laughs> find some, I might be obligated to make your dagger out of whatever was left. Ah, sounds like a good trade. Think about a few more questions. <coughs> sounds like a really good trade. Too bad I just sold my ore to the shop. My thanks to you, stranger. <coughs> my thanks to you, stranger. I'll be here when you find it. I'll be off then. How do I give him ore? Mm, hello, Lloyd. I can spare a few moments. It's back, sir. You provide wood. Mm, still looking for some ore. I had some ore, damn it! I had some ore in my pocket. I had iron ore. I sold iron ore. 
Oh my god. How much are you asking for the ore, mate? Beezer. Yes, yes. Uh, interesting. 32 coins. <laughs> okay, I'll bite. I'll bite. Never selling anything again. <coughs> Oops, sorry about that. Now, I bet it's worth more than a dagger. Uh, chicken. Over here, basically. <coughs> it's not pure ore, what? Why? Inventory, please. It's just iron ore, but it has to be pure ore, huh? So I can't give him the iron. Just like that. Oh boy. I made a mistake. Ooh, who are you? I cannot at all concern your state of dress. Let's partle. Let's partle then. He has clothes, yes! Uh, he has armor. A rustic finery. Hmm. Uh, and a sword. 37 gold. Uh, how much is this? 1000 gold. 73. Uh, 184 for this. Boots. Thermometer. So I made a mistake in buying back my stuff. Okay, first of all, we need a sword. I hope I can use it. <laughs> yes, I shall buy the sword. And I shall buy the clothes. Small, heavy, wool clothes. Uh, rustic finery. Small, heavy, wool clothes. Now, let's sell him everything else. Probably worth something. I don't want that. What do you want, my good man? He'll take for 10 coins. He doesn't want the metal. He doesn't want the gun parts. He doesn't want the herbs. Neither the grenades, neither the filament. But what do you want? The thermometer. Well, you, you are selling one, so yeah. Hmm. Although I might need a torch. Now let's talk to him. <clears throat> hmm. Perhaps you would be wanting the name of a good tailor. <laughs> Can you train me to be an apprentice? What sort of wares do you carry here? Can you tell me about the ring I found? I shouldn't ask. Take yourself a look around, sir. I got prices on lots of common stuff. A little of everything, you might say. Let me know if you I can help you with anything. Though he is short and annoying. Maybe a short and annoying voice. Hmm. Shall we better? Ah. Okay, now, finally, I can get dressed. Yes. Really? Really? Small. Small. Did you just cheat me? Although I did not ask for size. <laughs> well, there goes the rest of my money. Would you buy it back for 15 coins? No. I'm keeping it. <sighs> uh, really? Small, small, heavy, blue clothes. <laughs> Tell me about my character, please. Race, human, male, gender. <laughs> Hmm, armor class. Damage bonus minus one. Reaction modifier. This is adjustment. Actual reaction the others have. It's based on beauty. I'm ugly. So, yes, I will learn. Ah, uh, finally. But the thing is, it's not far away from reality. Now, can I use the sword at least? Ah, yes I can. Uh, Virgil, I would get you something else, but... You're kind of low on cash, my friend. We're poor again. What about chickens? What if I murder the town's chickens? Would anyone be, well, mad? Well, if no one sees it happen... 
Might as well kill one. Are you blind? What in God's I I mean, better luck next time. Oh, for fuck's sakes. <laughs> really? Really? Oh, for fuck. I did not save and Virgil is dead. All of that for a chicken. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> oh that's just sad. <laughs> there is no auto loader. Let's save. For so much, damn it! I forgot to save after I exit every building. Oh God, no! Why? The pain, the pain. Ah, <sighs> the pain. Virgil, the pain. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Sorry. At least I could do any idea I should start. Ahaha, <laughs> the pain. The pain. No, appear! Virgil, run! Virgil, run! Oh, we're dead. And seriously hurt, sir! Please help me! Virgil, run, damn it! Blind, what in God's eye, I mean, better luck next time! Really, I will kill the bear, but I lost Virgil. Oh no, I won't kill the bear. <laughs> Why, game? Why? Oh, this is sad. <laughs> sad in so many ways. Okay, now before we get savaged by a bear, it's time for a new save. After every fucking conversa conversation, it seems. Is there no way I can tell Virgil to run? Hello, oh, Joaquin is staying at the inn next to the bank. Yes. Mm hmm. Can okay, tell me what's place? Blah blah blah, why did you the stones? Strange picture, that's odd. What was the mine now? Thanks, I have my question. At least use quick save. I don't know what's the button. <laughs> if I knew what's the button, I would have used it. I would have survived. Can I see the controls? Options. Sound, video controls. Nope. <laughs> Okay, saving time. Now let's go to the corpses. Actually, let's go and buy the clothes first. F7, huh? Save complete. 
Oh, Ghost, you're a lifesaver. So, yes, hello, little one. I'll be Barter. I'm not buying the small suit again. I'll buy this. And I'll buy myself a sword. Oh my god. It was just sad. And things were going so well. Yeah, but what can you do? We will learn. In time. You can replay... At least you can replay, you don't buy that small clothing. That is true as well. <laughs> I have saved myself some coins. Although... And they won't walk naked everywhere all the time. Anymore. Uh, my inventory, please. Yes, put the clothes on. Use the sword. <laughs> and they won't run into a bear immediately. Okay, Virgil, let's go. Joachim's room is at the end of the hall on the left. Wait, wait, let me steal the shoes first. I mean borrow. Let me borrow this. <clears throat> let me borrow the shoes, Virgil. Let's not walk around barefoot. <laughs> barefoot. Yes. Uh, anything else I can take? No. I wonder, if I just lay and sleep in the bed, Oh no! Good God! What's happened here? He has nothing. These men, I, I've never seen them before. Except the medallion. <clears throat> I find it funny that, well, Joachim kind of looted them. Smart man. But he left us 20 gold. If I sleep in the bed, will I be charged? Sorry to interrupt, but it yes. seems Joachim has discovered something. Mm -hmm. He is... Well... Someone who helped me out when I... I... I'd... I'm sorry, Virgil, we had this conversation. Okay, now we can... Save... Conversation with the barkeep. Greetings, good sir. What can I help you with? I would like a room for the night. You've been in town for a while, a room for one week. Can you tell me about the ring I found? Hmm. I don't think it's smart for me asking around about the ring, but if we don't ask anyone, how will we know what to do? I beg your pardon. Hello, good ogre. Brr, hello there. Hello, good ogre. Might I ask who you are? Me. Ogre get seat is El Cap Town, puffing out his chest. Pat pathetically. I'm Sog. Mad Mug. Mad Mug? I'm sorry. Is that your family name? Nice to meet you, Sog. Could I ask you a few questions? <laughs> is that your family name? A curse. Don't you know anything? Hick. Wait, don't you know anything? Hick. Old ogre named stranger. Ogre name tells about the person or the family. Who's got them? Songs looks away, seeming a little confused. Come to come to think of it, maybe that ain't my real name. But it's what people call me around here. Yes, ogre. <laughs> May I ask a question? Sure. What do you want to know? What are you doing here? Shrouded hills. Can you tell me about this place? Me? Oh, not much. I work doing odd jobs, making a little coin when I <coughs> need it. Mostly spend my time in this here fine inn. I tell you, friend. <coughs> I've been just about every inn and travels in Arcanum, and I think this <coughs> is my favorite. <coughs> I see. What can you tell me about Shrouded Hills? Shrouded Hills? 
Hills, but bad place. Little boring. He wavers slightly. He's looking about ready to fall asleep. Can go nowhere right now, no. There are some bloody thieves at the bridge who won't let anyone <coughs> out of the town. Sharing a bloody troll. And I ain't got no money. Perhaps you should join me. Ah, yes. Perhaps you should. <coughs> I need your help. Looking to get out of town. Uh, I don't think so, friend. <coughs> no offers, but... I'm not sure. <coughs> not sure if I can convince that you... <coughs> you're the man I followed just yet. That's a question. What am I place? You're sure you won't join me, Sog? I'm looking to get out of town. What are you doing here? Shot he was... Uh, he doesn't want to join me, damn it! That's sad. Uh, nice to meet you. And who might you be? I'll be Jacob Benz. I don't usually waste my words on outlanders, but... Auslander. But you look like a man I might be having a need of. Hmm, perhaps. Speaking of me, I don't think I have any interest in anything you would have to say. Well, I ask him. <clears throat> like a man who hears opportunity when it comes knocking. Here's the word, stranger, and make sure to keep it to yourself. Out within, then. He lowers his voice, leaning to you. I'll make this short. Do you fancy yourself the thieving type, stranger? Uh, I'm a man of many talents, friend. Continue. <laughs> he smiles, looking to and fro, same ale drinking from his chin. I think I might... I, I thought I was right. Right about you. Listen, I'm no thief, but I've got some information to help us both get rich. I'm listening. But your charisma is 9, right? I don't think my charisma is 9. Uh, we shall check after this. I think it's 8. There's a bank here in town, and just yesterday the payroll from the Bessie town mine was deposited there for safekeeping. There's at least 500 pieces of gold in that safe. As we speak, he reaches into his pocket, producing a slip of paper. This here is the combination to the bank safe. Do I make myself clear, stranger? Crystal, good man, what's the catch? I'd rather not speak of it any further. <clears throat> ah, must get level then. Must level up. Must kill chicken, but not get murdered by guards. <laughs> Here's what's gonna happen. We split the take right down the middle. And word has it that the Oven gang is gonna rob this bank any day now. So you better... Burp. So you better... Burp. Do it soon as possible. And if I found out you're trying to... Okay. Skip town, I'll get the old doctor after you. Who's the doctor? The doctor, old Doc Roberts, is the only real law this here town. Got... Got God knows, Constable Owens. Lily Livered. I aren't going to do nothing about nothing. If a man needs something done in this town, Lovey, Lovey, then they do. Then they go to the dock, Roberts. And if he feels like it, then it gets done. I'm sure he's got money in the bank, so he'd be real interested in someone was going to steal it. The Bowman Gang. I see well that terms of our agreement, Jacob. The Bowmans? Oh, they're just a bunch of hell racers. They ride through here every once in a while when they think that all the Doc Robert ain't looking. I guess they must run out of <laughs> drinking money. And they're coming to make a withdrawal. I see. I think I have a deal, Jacob. We'll see if it's later. Hmm, so he wants me to steal, draw the bank. Uh, whom? What do you want? Hello, bartender. Ah, bartender! Hmm, I'd like to become an expert in gambling. 
a lot of extra haggling. This is actually good. Hello, bartender. What can I do for you? <clears throat> what can I do for you? I'd like a drink, please. Give me a drink. Not much on here, is there? Not much going on here, is there? Have you seen our new bank here in town? It's made out of bricks, strong as a mule. Everyone's keeping their money in it. You have my gratitude. Do you need anything else? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> have you heard anything interesting? Uh, you hear what happened to them? You hear what happened? That the magic users that tried to throw his weight around here, Dox Roberts brought him down with a shot between his eyes. You're most kind. <laughs> I must be gone now. Wait, can you. Haggler, I want to haggle. Uh, you have the skill necessary to be trained as an expert. Continue. Ah, I don't have the skill. Damn it. What is my charisma? Charisma is 8. I need one more level for the ogre then. How would we level up? Hmm. Hello, back to back. <laughs> Damn it. Shroud the hills. How can I help you today? Mm, I was just passing through. Thank you, good. Bye. Yes, sir. Hello, sir. May I ask you some questions? Yes, what is it? I'm looking for a training as an apprentice. What type of training were you seeking? Dodge, melee, throwing, spot trap. Never changed my mind. Let's try melee. You lack the acquired skill to be trained. Damn it, I must beg my leave. Well, I guess that's it for the bank. I see the safe. The safe looks nice. Uh, you. I do not know you, human. Oh, wait, is it worth I do not know you, human, nor do I want to. Please, I only wish some information. I do not feel there is any need for such rudeness. Hmm, I gather you are correct, sir. What is you want of me? I need information. What is it? Any news passed this way lately? Can you tell me anything about this ring? Don't go out to the old Bessie Tony. Mine, it's haunted. Thank you. Is there anything else? Goodbye. So, we definitely are going to go to the mine. Let's quickly go murder the rats. Yes, heal. Hit, hit, damn it, hit with the sword. Yes. Are you brother. blind? What in God's I I mean better luck next time. I think I keep stunning myself. Ah, I stun myself that I have to get out of that again. <laughs> well I guess that's what happened when you flail the sword around like a madman. So do we steal your harmonia? Nope. Uh, yes, and he must go down to the blacksmith. Hmm, I can steal his tobacco. Let's stay in there for now. Okay, dwarf, I'm coming to talk. Oh, another rat. Yes. Order it, kill it. Are you blind? What in God's I I mean better luck next time? Ah, uh, don't forget F7. I will never forget F7 again. Today, my good dwarf. We are not here to murder you. Yes, very pretty. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It is a nice steam engine. Ooh, can we play with the levers? <laughs> Control box, can't do anything. Okay. F7 Do your magic, my friend No, no Good, good it works Who are you? Man is uh, youngish gnome Dressed in well-made suit Excuse me 
Hmm, a gnome, you see? What does a gnome voice sound like? Uh, excuse me, but I couldn't help but notice that you're uh, new here in town. I've all heard about the Ice of Zephyr. Were you on the blimp where it crashed? Uh, mind your own business, sir. I rather not speak of it. Rather traumatized by the affair. Oh, please, sir. Uh, I must know. Were you on the blimp or not? I have a very good reason for waiting to know. I beseech you. Oh my god. You can only be the juror. If you must know, yes, I was on the blimp. I told you rather not speak. Okay, we will tell him we were on the blimp. Oh, thank you heavens. Then there were survivors. Did the others come here as well? Is there anything they... S mm, where are they staying? There were no other survivors. I was the only one. Are you sure? <clears throat> Damn it, I keep mixing the voice. Are you sure? The gnome looks... The gnome looks... Restfallen. My older brother was... He was on the blimp. A gnomish gentleman. Some years. Did you happen to see him, sir? I did see the gnome. Describe him. I'm sorry, but he's died. dead. Hmm. I did meet the gnome. What did you say your name was? I'd rather forget the whole affair. Thank you very much. Uh, let's... Let's... Let's die. His face goes pale. <gasps> no, not Preston. He's silent for a moment. He's silent for a moment, looking away. I see then. Uh, you, sir, you've been most helpful. I'm sorry for your loss. Good day to you. Wait. Hold me. Find the boy. Give him drink. But who is this gnome, damn it? Gnome village. You have nothing left to talk about, sir. I have arrangements to make. Good day to you. <laughs> what is it that you want of me? Good day to you as well. Damn it, gnome. Are you the one I was looking for? What is your name? Talk to me, damn it. Fish Slider and Sons. Hmm. You know what? I'll keep the ring. But I could give you his passport. Preston Rashley. Well, hello there. Now that I have clothes, will you. Or rabbit. Hmm, what is it? And you are good, sir? Oh, yeah, we read this. Uh, we changed. Uh, we just chance to stop by. Fascinating. Could you answer the questions? As you always refer to yourself in third person, look resistor. Oh, third person, I never realized. Just a question. Well said, good man. Few questions. Actually, what can you tell me about the noting? Let us. Barter, yes. Now, take the necklaces, I don't need them. Mm, I have two stun grenades. Uh, take the salt and pepper, at least one. You won't buy the spikes, take this. You shall save the ore. I would sell all the junk to him, but I think it's stuff I will need. I'll save the camera. Damn it. Ah, we shall see. We might return. Okay, you, I need a quest from you. I need to find you the ore. <laughs> Pick lock. This metal trap. You're not ready for apprentice ring. Damn it! No, wait. Just a few more questions. Oh, he sells weapons as well. Five hundred coins, you see? A giant hammer. Ah, hunting rifle. Which I probably can't shoot. Metal shavings. Do you want to buy something from me? That's a better question. Uh, what about your? 
My offer is 6 coins. Ooh, he will pay 26 for this. Not this is paying, not doesn't want filament, doesn't want any of these. <laughs> hmm, most items have a use, but your character might not be able to use them. That is true. So they're actually taking up space, no inventory for nothing. <laughs> oh, that's sad. It's hard decision. I might need the metal, damn it, or something. I might find a quest and they'll say, Oh, do you have a sheet of metal? I'll say, Oh, I had, but I sold. Oh, he has a hammer. Uh, could have spare a few moments. How this has been lately? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's a good trade, I'll do. Mm -hmm. I need a safe or something like that to put my stuff away. Uh, what about you, Gnome? Okay, he's apprentice. Here I go. Can you tell me about the ring I found? Nope, let us trade. I am wondering, did I make a mistake for, well, not talking to the Gnome? <laughs> for not giving him the ring. The one ring. The one to rule them all. Yes, take the salt and pepper. Uh, matches? No, 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 no. Cool. He will not buy this, but will you buy the sheet? Hmm. Spikes? Nope. Filament? Nope. Gun parts? Nope. Let me buy the curbs. And they take a lot of space. You either drop them or unlock them. Ah, herbology. I understand now. Mm. Let us straight. Let me sell everything. Hide. Not interested. Doesn't want filament. I will sell everything. I will collect stuff later. I might make a huge mistake, but what can one do? Such is life. Take. I can't use it anyway, so. Yeah. Might as well get rid of it, we have space. But I'll keep the gun parts. <laughs> Thank you. You! Buy my junk. Oh. I meant no, no, not the ring. But Ghost, I have a question to ask. I wish to know. If I start showing people the ring, will it come back to bite me in the ass? I have a feeling it will. I will keep the cylinder, might make a better gun later. Uh, the dynamite, yes, it is a suicidal thing, but what can one do? This fuck I sold in the spring, I might have needed it. Yeah, screw it. Take it all. Yeah, much better. What is it that you want of me? Sorry, Virgil. Nothing. So, where do we go now? Yes, F7, before we die. <laughs> I wonder, will the, gu the guards kill me for stealing? Come on, villager. May I speak with you for a moment? Anything newsworthy happening? I saw Jacob being slouching around the Loaders heal in. I don't trust that man. On beat, I'll tell you. Hmm, I'll make me leave. <laughs> well, you already tell everyone information that should be a secret. Ah, the fact that I crashed the, the Zeppelin. Well, fuck. <clears throat> Yoink. Old Bessie! Wait, the cow! She is old Bessie! Moo! Moo cow! Moo! <laughs> Moo for me, Bessie! Hmm, scarecrow. 
Hello there. Hello there. <laughs> Guards don't care until you have to unlock a chest. Ah. I speak to you for a moment. What can I do for you, sir? Can you tell me anything about drink? <laughs> it said... Well, <clears throat> I said no. I said... <clears throat> Wait, I need a lady voice. <clears throat> it said no. No one knows more about exotic objects than reason. The importer. You have my gratitude. Is there anything else? No, I'll be leaving. Your shriveled voice is a problem. Please, I'm on duty. <laughs> I need to practice training. What news making the rounds? I heard that our local herbalist, Gailin, is a sign of great elven healers. <laughs> elven he Herbalist? Plants? Herbalist might buy plants. Uh, map, please. Do, 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 do. What house did I not to visit? Huh, I bet this sir. Yes. Nope. Don't get scared until you have trouble. Chest. Oof! Pharmacy. Yes. I would. Why is there blood here? Hello there. Hello, what is it? And who might you be, sir? I'm called Dr. Roberts. In these parts, we might you be. Ah, I'm Kisilina Serba. Well, Kisilina, if there's nothing else, I'll be taking you... Thanking you to get... I'll be thanking you to get along. Wait. Is there any work to be had around here? Can you train me to be extra firearms, sir? You don't have the skill necessary to train expert them. Apprentice? Firearms? Oh, he wants coins. We don't have that many. I mean, we have, but I might need them for something. I would like to be healed. No. Doctor? Guess what? Yeah, can we tell me? Would you like to receive? Is there any work that can be around? around? Yes. The veteran old man looks you over as if appraising you potential you might accidentally possess. There might be something. You don't mind putting your hide in dangerous way. I'm not aware. I'm not averse to a bit of danger, provided the pace, right? Word was reached me that the Bowman gang is coming in the road of the bank. Too bad for them that my money happens to be in there. So, what do you need me for? You didn't mention what the pay was. <laughs> I could use someone to watch my back. In there ain't no one worth their salt in this town. Sounds intriguing. What will you pay for my help? Well, that all depends, Kisselina. Do you fancy yourself magicker or a scientist? Hmm. I have been known to double in magic arts. A partial. <coughs> Damn it. <coughs> If you show everyone the ring in this town, I don't think it will bite you. It might even help. <coughs> the thing is, Yorick, Yarak, whatever his name is, told us that there are people in town, well, assassins. And he was attacked by assassins. If I show the ring, I get the feeling that people might come after me. Uh. I try yes, I tried to walk the middle ground, as if it were. Being the town's so bones. <coughs> Being the town's so bones, I've inherited quite an arsenal of exotic weapons, wandering adventures, adventurers dying on the table, and what not. I take whatever they may have in pay. You understand, I think I have. He looks around. Ah yes, here it is. Finally made battle axe. I'll give it to you afterwards, if you back me up when the trouble starts. I'm intrigued by your offer. What would I need to do? Nothing about this whole thing. I have a pounder in the future. Meet me in the. F meet me in front of the bank. I'll be keeping an eye out for the trouble to start. When it does, I'll expect you to buy me by my side.
I'll see you out there then. Wait, he's going right away. Oh my god. I might have made a mistake. Well, can I sleep in his bed? Ah, uh, you made a mistake. You left your house unguarded. And I see a rat. Probable cause. Now I must enter and investigate. Must murder the rat. Oh, come on, it's locked. Okay, let's go and get killed again. Although there are many guards outside, so... It might not end badly. Hmm, human guard. Doc Roberts. There you are. Are you ready to throw in with me? I haven't seen the boys roll in town yet, but... That doesn't mean they ain't already here. Yes, I'm ready. Damn! They slipped inside somehow. Let's put those folks six feet under, boy! I'm with you. Suddenly this seems... <laughs> <laughs> That'd be too real for my taste. I'm leaving. I'm with you. Let's go. Damn it! Why do I have to go first? You best get your tail in that bank before I feel full of lead, boy. <laughs> Stab him! Stab him! Stab him! Yes! Stab! 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 Ah, I survived. Ah, uh, really, really, man. Oh, heavy woolen clothes. Yes, I'll take. I'll take your revolver as well. <laughs> and loot, finally. Oh my god, he looks a bit bluish. Something's wrong. Guard. I'll take your uniform as well. <laughs> yes, steal everything. Uh, might be running out of room. I will sell. Doesn't matter that one of the guards was a good guy. We take all. Damn it. Oh my god, I have to get rid of something. I need so much room for a pistol. Even, th Even though it's a trash pistol, I will. I want it. I need it. It's money. I have no room for the battle axe. That's gonna suck. Well, we did our bit. Mind if I sleep in your bed? Let's say just for an hour. Take a short nap. Yes. Oh, thank you so much. You're a hero. Is there anything else I can do for you? I'm just passing through. Thank you. Good day. I'm here to make withdrawal. Reach for the skies. <laughs> we can't. I have to be smart about it if I'm going to rob the safe. But if I try to get in, oh, it's locked. So I can use Virgil as storage. Smart, smart, smart. Oh, Virgil. What is it that you want of me? Let's trade. I don't need so much wooden clothes, but I'll keep this jacket. Oh, wait. Ah, different. Durability 12. Accuracy 7. Uh, FR. What is FR, damn it? FR, FR, FR. Hmm. Doesn't seem to show. Nope, don't have a level. Virgil, you'll be my carry mule. Me? Oh, thank you, Ghost. That's a great idea. Come on, my sweet, sweet Virgil. Let's trade. Take. Okay, I will sell this. You know what? Virgil, wait. Uh, yeah, he took this. Hmm. I'll ha let you have a gun. Can I give him some bullets? No, I guess he's not the gun type, huh? Give you a spike. You can carry all of my shit herbs, yes. You are a priest, of course. Carry all of my shit herbs. I'll carry the stuff that can be sold, okay? I'll be in charge of the money. Fire resistance. Ah, FR fire resistance. Good to know. Now, let's go and sell the crap we don't need. Arrows you can keep for now, Virgil. Uh, take one stun grenade as well. Uh, yes, the metal plates. Take them. Oh, he can carry a lot. 
encumbrance. No, good, good, good. Uh, take the charcoal as well. Fatigue restoration, I'll keep that. Take the coal. Take my beautiful spikes. Take the knife. Take the sheets of paper. And the rest of the stuff we will sell. <laughs> Is this pistol better than my pistol? That's a good question, actually. It's a revolver. Oh, can I give him... What is this? Uh, durability 3, fire resistance minus 5, accuracy 3. Virgil, would you mind changing your suit? Armor class... Ah! 7... Yes, this is actually better than what you're wearing. Virgil? Yes? And I just bought the suit, damn it! There you go, much better. Hmm? Uh, no, E. They keep the fine clothes on me. Well, we shall sell your crappy coat. I will wear this from now on. Yes, 12. <coughs> now, damage 1 to 5. Trash, uh, minus 10, range 5. Range 8, 10. Fire, FT. Fire, what? 1 to 5. Hmm, it seems better. It's a failure 0. It's a failure 0. It seems better than my pistol. Okay, Virgil, I have new stuff for you to carry. <laughs> what is it that you wanted? <laughs> Let's raid. <clears throat> you can keep my old gun. You can keep. No, I'll sell one of these. Uh. I want to give him, damn it. You can keep my good clothes. I don't know, I might need them for something. No, I, I won't. Uh... Yeah, take the camera with you. I'll keep the passport of the dwarf. Yeah, much better. Now we can sell stuff. Hmm. But, Virgil, do you prefer to use the knife or the stick? What does it say about what? Oh my god. What does it say about your stick? Is the knife better? Uh, 1 to 4 damage, FD 2 to 9. No, Virgil, damn it! Stop arming yourself. Yes, your stick is actually better than everything else. Good. Okay, let's steal the ammoniac and let's sell it. Oh no, wait, let's get the axe. Hello again, constable. A pleasure, have you a moment? Got some questions. Mm hmm. I already told you, thieves made you an offer. Do you want to take care of them for 50 gold? Done. Great. Ah, we did it. I look forward to hearing about your success. Come back when you solve the problem. Oh damn it, I thought that we killed them in the bank. I was hoping we killed them in the bank. Uh, doctor? I need my battle axe, damn it. Okay, let's sell. Mm -hmm, let's trade. I don't need this suit. I don't need this suit. Oh, he doesn't want it. <laughs> yes, pick it. I don't care. Hmm. For two coins for one of the pistols. Yes, take it. Ah, much better. Uh, and yes, take this as well. Now we're off. <clears throat> yeah, let's visit the houses we did not visit. Oh, it's locked. Yeah. Hmm. 
Good day, man. Speak. <coughs> Elf villager. Speak up, human. Do not mumble. Speak up, human. Do not mumble. Can I look at your trading goods, miss? Hmm. Can you train me to be an apprentice? Can you train me to be an expert trader? I'm looking for work. Do you require assistance with anything? What do you have to trade? Ah, she has herbs. Will she buy herbs? This is not for sale. <laughs> oh, she has bread. Hmm, will you buy my suit? No. You don't want it, huh? Virgil, excuse me. What is it that you I want? Have to say it. I need my pants back. I need to sell them. I have to find someone to buy them. Hmm, which one the railroad spike? Want the charcoal or the coal? Charcoal? Maybe the metal? A good man. Let's wait. I will not buy that. I will not. Why won't you buy the plants? Damn it. Maybe this? This? <sighs> you suck, elf lady. You suck. What is it that you want of me? Virgil, take the junk back, please. Take the junk back. Now let's talk. Can you train me to be an apprentice? Hmm, what type of training would you seek? Heal. Skills are not refined enough for apprentice training. <laughs> Damn it. Looking for work, do you require assistance with anything? This town is small and my needs are few. There is nothing I need. An Auslander to do. For me, she looks your way seeming distant. And though for a moment you appear a traveler, Tell me, do you wander far? I'm new to this land. I suspect my travels will take me far. I'm only just beginning my journey. I know not how far I will go. Well then, if you're wandering, <laughs> you happen to come across an elven amulet engraved with the name Entla upon its face. I would ask you to return it to me as it's old family heirloom stolen a generation ago. Hmm, it may be. I have not the slightest inkling of its whereabouts, looking slightly bemused. I cannot fathom why I have even told you of it. Perhaps these many years have confused my mind. Well, no matter. If you do happen to happen upon it, I would reward you handsomely. Now, is there anything uh, more I can for you. <clears throat> I'm looking for a trainer. No, would you give me interest in training? Good day, ma'am. Mind if I locked the lantern? Well, good day, ma'am. Ooh, 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 ooh. Someone's bad. Really, nothing. Peasants. Well, might as well sleep in your house for a... No, we shall... It's it's morning, it's just morning. So, what does the map say? Oops, sorry. I'll get the edge of the map. Hmm, two more houses here. Oop. Ah, I can sneak! On A! I did not know that. <laughs> no? Interesting, interesting. Anything around here I can take? Hmm, the water. Ah, we cannot cross the river. Ah, I see. What is this pig? Coink, coink. 
Mm, you appear to be dirty pig. Dirty, dirty pig. Anything I can borrow? Huh? Tom's fertilizer. Liquid soap. I shall not carry the fertilizer with me around. Oh, here's the here's the mine. Ah, I see. Is there anything else I want to check around in town first? Nope, wrong button. Arrow keys. Do your magic. Uh -huh, unexplored. Wait, he's in front of the bank waiting for us. Uh, we have been everywhere, it seems. Oh, uh -huh, not there. Up there. Ah, that's the bandits at the bridge. Oh, we can't fight them. <clears throat> okay, let's run to the man, get our battle axe. They probably won't be able to use, but what can one do? Hmm, was I in this house? Locked. Can I pocket? No. Prowling. No. Uh, disarm trap. Repair. Prowling. Hmm. I can't pick lock. Damn it. That's that's sad. Well, not yet. At least. Uh, what was this house? Hmm. Hmm. Good day to you. <laughs> Captain Visa. And you might be? I'm John Guldune, <clears throat> a learned wizard and alchemist. If you have a problem in surrounded hills of magical nature, I'm the person to see. You have caught me at a bad f uh, time, friend. Perhaps we could speak later. It's a pleasure to meet you. Might be of assistance? Well, perhaps. I have problems in shrouded hills of most delicate nature. Strictly confidential, if you get my meaning. Of course, I might. If you. <clears throat> hmm. Probably nothing I want to involve myself with. Yeah, I want to get involved. Certainly. I seek apprentice training. Persuasion. My skill requires level to. Your skill is not at the required level to be trained as an apprentice. Damn it. <coughs> May I ask a question? Uh, what is the nature of your problem? <laughs> Maybe that's what we should have asked immediately. So what is the nature of me? Hmm. Well, leans towards you looking around secretively. That's conspiracy here in some fields, a dark plan full of mystery and intrigue. Mystery and intrigue? Interesting, exactly what seems to be going on. The whole town is out to get rid of me. <laughs> they have been brainwashed by the constable owns. And now it's only a matter of time before I'm forced to leave. I see. What has Constable Owens done to you? What has he done to me? The man has endangered the natural balance, which always allows me to put bread on my table. Do you have any idea what the pr uh, presence of his bloody steam engine does to my magical abilities? No, what are you talking about? I see you're speaking the nature of magic and technology. The balance technique, technological ga, gadgetry, gadgetry, it accepts the flaws of which I prefer my miracles of magic and alchemy. Magic and technology are very different. <coughs> magic works against the laws of nature, while technology is very dependent on them. So, that machine makes 
it difficult to cast spells and do my experiments. This business is bad. That's a shame, especially in such a big city like Shrouded Hills. <laughs> Sarcasm, we lost on him. Yes, if only there was someone to do something about it. He throws a hooded glance your way. What exactly do you propose? Hmm. He's always loyal lawyers. If you could find a way to disable that infernal machine, I might be able to part with a couple of healing potions. What do you say? But the nail is still on the good side of the law. I see. What choice is yours? Perhaps some other time. Yeah, I am still on the good side of the law. I'm wearing a lawman's uniform. If you haven't noticed. Ah, here he is. Oh yeah, you scratch his head. Oh yeah, I owe something. Don't I? Well, here you go, and uh, don't have much experience attacking people, but uh, thanks. Yes, I should doing business with you, sir. We'll be seeing you around, perhaps. Good luck. How's it going now? Axe. Can I use it? Damage 1 to 12. My sword 1 to 8. Can I even use the damn thing? That's the question. Five. Oh. Hmm, it seems better in every way. Virgil. Virgil, would you mind carrying what the sword? What is it that you want to? Yes, take it. Hmm. What is it that you want of me? No. Good day to you, Virgil. Good day. We have to sell our junk clothes, damn it. And perhaps the happening in the store will be interesting. Teddy Woods, he's not interested in this. Why find suit? Sorry, you don't want soap, huh? Dirty, dirty halfling. Nice suit. What did I sell then? Rustic finery, eh? So, where do we go from here? What did they agree to? First bank of skills. Hmm. We can do for this guys. What goes on around here, good woman? There's been strange folk around here lately. Been asking about Andrali. Prophecies and whatnot. You're most helpful, ma'am. Is there anything else? Also, X is good at destroying wooden stuff without damaging the weapon. In combat mode, press Alt on an object. Ah! So I might be able to break down a door, you say? That, 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 that. Hmm. That's good to know, Ghost. Good to know indeed. Wait, let's go back to the doctor. Uh... I don't have a skill. Not bloody likely, my good sir. <laughs> okay, let's go check out the mine. I think that's something we should get up to. So I should rest first. Let's sleep. In this house. <laughs> in this barn. <laughs> uh, yes, until morning. First thing in the morning we visit the mine. <laughs> ah, good, 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 you're right. I will say. <laughs> oh, wait. Have I visited this thing? Yes, I have. It's the big style. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Here's the mine. I might die brutally, but one never knows. Hmm. Prepare the axe. No inventory. Inventory. Hmm. I need a torch. 
We're watching the battle. Oh, lantern! Hmm. How does the lantern work? I would like the lantern in my other hand. Oh, but then I can't use the axe. Ah, oh, never mind. Screw the lantern. We can see in the dark. Although I get the feeling the game is going to penalize me by making me miss most of my attacks. It's 3 a.m. here, so I must go. If you get stuck somewhere, then read the Discord DM. I will watch replay this thing. <coughs> oh, it's okay, Ghost. I could, I could end it here as well. Huh? Shall we continue tomorrow? Our adventure in the mine. Ah, I see iron ore, steel. I think we have done enough. Hmm, let's just murder one of the wolves for good measure. To see. Hello, wolf. Critical uh, needs damage, armor damage. Yes, die, wolf, die. No, no, don't you run, don't you run, just die. Wolf, damn it. I keep hacking at it like a maniac, can't hit it. And one more, just one. Shits and giggles. Hit from this damage. Unconscious. Goodbye, wolf. Anyway, ghost, thank you for sticking by and for watching. I hope it was interesting. And I'll see you tomorrow, my friend. Let's save. And to anyone else who stumbled by, thank you very much for watching. If you watched, if you did not watch, well, thanks anyway. See you tomorrow, folks.